This video will show you how to replace the helical rotor. You will need a Phillips screwdriver, a 10mm spanner, a 13mm spanner, a 5mm allen key and a replacement rotor. You will see that the replacement rotor is made out of two parts. First step is to remove the sieve from the side of the pump using your Phillips screwdriver. Next, there are three bolts on top of the pump that you need to loosen using your 10mm spanner. You can now remove the top part of the pump and also remove the top part of the helical rotor that needs to be replaced. Now use your allen key to remove the, the top part of the pump from the pump motor. Feed the wire through this part and loosen it. Now use your 13mm spanner to keep the pump shaft in place and remove the bottom part of the helical rotor that needs to be replaced. Take your new helical rotor and now install the bottom part of your new helical rotor. Once it is on tight, you can then replace that part of the pump. You can now replace the top part of the new helical rotor as well. Reassemble the pump and tighten all the bolts. Once they are all tight, using your spanner and allen key, the last thing to do is replace the sieve and you have successfully replaced the helical rotor.